Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Kids Python Challenge. Okay, um, let's continue our work on the uh, card flipping game. So uh, let's see uh, where were we last time. So card flipping game four, lesson 57. We done the check. We tried to um, flip the cards in order of the number. So, um, yeah, it was like that. Okay, let's let's check the uh, let's quickly run it and see if um, yeah, uh, maybe we need it. Okay, we need this box because <laughs> we need to check the correct number. Okay, let's see it. So, um, the correct number is for this. So, of course, we can click anywhere we like. But what we want is we want to flip in order of number number one. Next is number two. Uh, next is number three. Okay, let's wrongly flip. But actually, we wanted to flip it four and uh, five, um, which is six. Six is here. Uh, seven is here. Eight is here, and let's see, nine. So um, we got we got to we reach nine. So we should this should be the end of the game. Okay. So uh, let's see how we can improve this. So the homework when done, print congrats in the message area. So let's see. Uh, let's see how we. Actually, we don't need this anymore. So let's remove this mouse control. So um, here, um, actually, we failed to see that um, done is not correct. So let's see. Next N is hmm, Y. Good nine. Done. Done. Here. Nine. 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 Okay. So, uh, actually, uh, yeah, right. So the point is, uh, we need to uh, use the same um, logic to find that it's done. So let's see. After this one, okay, maybe we need to write um congrats here so it's like if um the same if self dot uh next n uh, equals or larger than say n n times n n okay um print uh, no no pixel pixel um text the position is the same as almost the same as um, this one right so okay let's use this um the x position should be plus bb plus maybe two times one time uh ss times one okay and the y position is the same okay and the word is congrats okay good say uh what in what color um maybe in eight let's see how it is look like okay so quickly check that so one, two, three. Ah, uh, let's see the cheat sheet. Four, five. Ah, uh, let's see six, seven, um, eight. Congrats. Okay. Uh, it's wrong. Okay, it should be bigger than an N. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, at, at the same time, um, we notice that we don't need to change the colors anymore. Okay, so let's go on. 
basically it's fine. Uh, I changed it to, uh, let's see. Okay, so this should be fine. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, uh, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, congrats, good. Okay, so what's next? So today's work, um, paint differently when the flip is correct. Okay, so it, it's like this. Um, paint differently uh, for those already flipped correctly cards. Okay, so let's do that. Um, so um, paint differently if the card number is, that means paint differently if the card number is less than next dot, next n. So maybe we can do this this way. Um, down here, we can overpaint. We we can um, paint over using that logic. So, for example, it's like this: for um, i in range, say zero up to self dot mm, next n. And paint like hmm. okay. Uh, find the position. Find out the position. How can we find out the position of the x and y? Say x equals um that number. Okay, so we can find out in the in the, let's see, uh, uh, in the, this self dot card, okay? We can find out the position as, okay? So position is um, self dot card find, I, okay, and then we can paint it, okay? We can check that, x equals cos percent nn, y equals cos slash slash nn, um, to make sure that we can check that, cos um, maybe i, Ah, that's 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 something wrong. Okay, so maybe paint it. We can paint it. Pixel rect um x times s. Ah, uh, no, no, sorry. X times s s uh, plus bb y times ss plus bb. And ties is horizontally x, horizontally ss, in color, say, 3. Okay. Also, for, to make it sure that we can write that number the same, same way as this. Very... Um, almost the same position. Maybe we know that it should be plus nine, as we found out, plus 10. And string is string i. And in color, say six. Let's see this if it's fine. Okay, let's run this. Okay, something is wrong. List object has not reviewed find. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, sorry, it's not find, it's index, I meant to. Okay, L let's check that. So uh, if the list is like two, five, one, we can find the position of five as index five, and it returns one, 
right? Okay, so this should be fine. Okay, let's run it. Something is wrong. Zero is not in list, I see. It should be one I plus one. Hmm, I see. So I should start from one. I see, okay. Okay, so plus plus one. Okay, let's let's try this. Either way, um ah maybe we, we should change this to back to this and write plus one and plus one. Okay, let's 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 run it and see if it's correct. Okay. Uh something is wrong. One. Hmm. I see. One should be here, and two, and three. It's wrong. It's not going up. Uh, what's wrong with it? Okay, uh, so I see. Uh, it should be up to the previous correct number. So it should be minus one here. Um, by the way, we notice that the initial position is always painted in purple, which is not good. So maybe we can change this to negative one, negative one. And then uh, maybe we can uh, draw only if the um, okay, so maybe we can write we can write here. that um, if uh, self dot p x is negative or self dot p y is negative, then maybe we can just continue without drawing anything. This will make it better. So let, let's run it. Okay, continue not properly in loop. I see, it should be return because it's not in the loop, but in function, okay? Let's run it. Okay, so it's, um, nothing is in purple, but if we click in wrong place, it's in purple, okay? But we, click on the correct position of one, it's in, okay, uh, light green, okay? And next one is, should be here, but, okay, two, uh, three, fine, four, uh, four is here, okay? Five, the, the, uh, six, seven, um, eight, and nine, congratulations, good. So it's working fine. Um, this is what we wanted, okay? It's a bit, uh, there is a bit trouble, but play, print play time and number of trials. Okay, um, do you remember how to um, measure time? Okay, let's do it. So quickly do it. Uh, maybe import time. And say we initialize the starting time here. Okay. Self dot uh, s time equal equals time dot time dot time. And then when done, we stop it and write the time. Okay. When done. Maybe here is when done. Self next. Okay. Yeah. Right. So maybe we can uh, stop the it um, last time is time dot time minus s time self dot s time.
And then we can write, okay, in, let's use if, uh, Okay, done in um, E time. To make it uh, two digits, we use dot two dot two F. Sec. Okay, that's one thing. And also, uh, we can do this also in the message box, but maybe you do it yourself. And also, um, and in a uh, number of clicks. Uh, say that's that's where uh self dot and click. Clicks. Okay, let's see it. Okay, so the time it's working. Uh okay. One, two, um three. Maybe, of course, we can see the clock somewhere. Five. But maybe it's a homework. Six, seven, eight, eight. Oh, it's... Ah, ah something is wrong. S time. Self dot S time. It didn't start well. What's wrong with this? S time self dot s time okay sorry okay so maybe this is fine okay ah maybe finishing condition is wrong what's wrong um finishing condition is larger than n n okay so uh i think this is good enough Please check yourself. Measure playtime and print. Print also the number of flip trials. Okay, uh, the rest is up to you. Homework, try another board size or other board sizes. Okay, um, hope you can run the code. Um, please stop the video and check it if you want to um, make sure about the code. Okay, one, two, let's see the cheat cards three um four five six seven eight nine okay and it's like 16.363 seconds with no mistakes okay try yourself um with some variations hope you'll come back next time bye bye